I hope you're having fun. I sure did. Recently on a trip to Marquette, Michigan, all sorts of great food. And in just a minute, I'm going to make a, a cheese spread that we found at a lot of the restaurants there. Um, I guess they're known for this fluffy cheddar cheese spread. They put it on breadsticks, and it's just yummy. And so I, I got home from the trip, and I thought, i got to figure out how to make that cheese spread. And, and I think I nailed it. So we'll show you how to make it in just a minute. But right now, if you're uh, looking for a wonderful, elegant restaurant when you're in Marquette, maybe a, a great place to go for a martini or a glass of wine or a really nice lunch or a delicious dinner. You, you love steaks, you love seafood. We found the place. Great atmosphere, too. Check out Elizabeth's Chop House right downtown Marquette. Beautiful inside and an amazing wine list, too. Take a look. For 20 years or more, this building was the Shamrock Bar. It was a uh, Irish-style pub that had a lot of college kids, a stage, live music. So Tom and I took the building. When we walked in, we actually stripped it from the walls down. Everything has been replaced except the bar and the brick walls that were here in the original historical building. One of the things we really love about the building is the Art Deco bar. As we were remodeling, we were taking down the old plaster walls and behind that we actually found this original Art Deco work behind the bar and we decided to leave it because we thought it was just gorgeous. We like to consider ourselves fine dining but casual atmosphere. Our servers will give you the top quality professional service that you would expect in any four or five star restaurant. However, we like to think that the people can come right up off the boats in their flip-flops, tank tops if they'd like, or someone coming in from a hard day's work in the mines. They're welcome to come in as they are and just enjoy our fabulous restaurant. This is the place to come. Um, we pride ourselves in having the finest cuts from the Midwest. My husband Tom has researched a lot and we've actually flown into Kansas City, Missouri, talked with the packing company that takes care of and provides our meats for us, and we get a really wonderful product. Seafood is flown in fresh two to three times a week. Uh, we get fish from all over the world. We, we feature things like mong chong, barramundi, uh, black sea bass, Chilean sea bass. Crab legs are probably the biggest you've ever seen. So most legs are over a pound by themselves. Our baked potatoes are huge. They're, they're wonderful with uh, butter. And then some people like to have them with uh, pancetta and a nice Wisconsin four-year-old cheddar. You know, salads are, are taken very seriously, as everything is. We, we do a real nice job with a different presentation on a Caesar salad. We have a rendition of the popular wedge salad. And our house salad is uh, mixed greens tossed in an apple champagne vinaigrette, topped with blue cheese, candied walnuts, and diced apples. Save room for dessert. Uh, Many things are available at the Chop House, including chocolate indulgence pie, our towering carrot cake, uh, creme brulee, the Chop House favorite, bananas Foster's bread pudding, and a 40-year tradition of chocolate strata pie. But you won't leave here hungry. Not by any means. Uh, probably with a doggy bag. We are in the heart of downtown, and like I said, we have a deck that seats about 60 people overlooking the lower harbor of Lake Superior. It's a gorgeous spot with plenty of parking, lots of other shopping, lots of other restaurants here, so that when you come downtown, you can feel almost like you're in a dining mecca. You know, it's a wonderful place for entertainment, for shopping. We have a fresh farmer's market. It's a really great place to be.